gonna start the video. <laughs> just you going wee. Wee. <laughs> well, Louie took control of the ship. <laughs> yeah, let's, let's blame it all. Yeah, then Omar Louis. came out of the bathroom and started saying, Get away from that! Stop it! <laughs> Louie right? just hisses at him and returns back to his <laughs> yeah. cockpit. <laughs> Quit <laughs> turning like the porta potty upside corner. down to hate when people are in it. <laughs> That's just nasty. I don't think you should have a porta potty on a spaceship. That probably wouldn't. No. Well. No, no. No, it wouldn't. So, welcome back, everyone. And don't worry, there are no random porta potties in this episode. Well, you already mentioned one, so that's a lie. <laughs> yeah. Let's just uh, go back to the Awakening Wood and uh, finish up what we left off here. Don't worry, there are no other lies in this video. Sure. Have we lied to you before? <laughs> Never. I would never lie to the, our kind viewers that I love so dearly for That's watching the our channel. The ones that may or may not be subscribed? Well, they better be subscribed, otherwise I'm gonna come to their fucking house. <laughs> <laughs> then they're lying to us and we can't have that. <laughs> exactly. This is, it's a two-way street. This is, trust goes both ways. Oh, I only oh, have yeah, 17 we blues. Have blue Pikmin oh, now. No, you gotta get more blue blues. Pikmin. Yeah. I forgot about the blue Pikmin. Man, I've forgotten that I've barely spent any time at all trying to raise Pikmin. Yeah, I'm really not. <laughs> I'm just so focused on getting through everything quickly. Oh, they were trying to get is, more is Pikmin this, on their own. Is this the episode where we uh, figure out how Pikmin are born? <laughs> well, you Auto see. Synthesis? Oh, more and Louie sit down and have a chat. <laughs> now, Louie, this is where Pikmin comes from. It's like a horrible Eldritch tale. <laughs> well, we only, God only knows what goes on inside that onion. Yeah. Log of death and decay? I'm not sure I want to. Yeah, we need a uh, white Pikmin to take care of that. What? White Pikmin? That's crazy. I'm trying to remember how to play the game. It has been a few weeks. <laughs> you probably do use the blame Pikmin 3. Yeah. Yeah, because that's the way it goes with me and Halos. Yeah, seems, seems <laughs> I get used to one way of Halo. Nothing else just changes. Yeah. Actually, Lou, I'm going to need you, believe it or not. Whoa, Louie's useful for something? Every once in a while. Since when? For now. <laughs> You have oh shit, Pikmin someone's drowning. drowning. <laughs> White Pikmin tried to go for Louie. And he did. Well, One less White Pikmin now. That's great. <laughs> you have enough blues to even carry that? Uh, it's probably, yeah, it's just 15 and I have 17, so just enough. Barely. <laughs> yeah, because he's gonna have some way down the thing. <laughs> yeah. So this is uh, gonna be a slow process. <laughs> And this, kids, is what you get for not stocking up on Pikmin before you do things. Sheesh. You Talk kill a white Pikmin, Pikmin and then you barely have enough blue Pikmin to even do what you set out to do. I mean, hey, we're only going to one cage today, and this is the, the last above ground treasure I think we need to get in this area, so it's <laughs> One fine. more. You know, let's get rid of this poison. No, keep it there. I got that one that bridge pretty quick. Yeah, they did actually. I'm so didn't sometimes have them sometimes it the takes a first. while, it seems like. Yeah, I'm sure like each structure has like its own values in terms of well, yeah. how long it takes to complete. Oh look, not. the bony bro. I think it bony also depends wall. on the length of said bridge too. Oh, that too, yeah. And watch it go back up. No, it that's should. not how math works. Yes. Yeah, because Louie obviously weighs nothing. <laughs> well, clearly. Now we do. Even though the amount of food that he eats, he should weigh a lot. <laughs> yeah. Technically, you didn't even eat even I think they need a bath. Because they didn't go through the water. <laughs> Technically, no, but so doing any other way would be trouble. dangerous. For no reason. No. If I remember right... Take down the bone This walls. isn't yep. a boss arena. Oh my god, it is a boss arena. How could anybody have known that a large open space was going to be where you'd fight a boss? 
<laughs> with surprisingly nothing in it. Come on, buddy. Come on. You were too there slow. Let's think we'll remember that. Well, he won't be able to remember much when he's dead. Oh god, he's going down easy. I think this is even easier than the last snagger he fought. <laughs> and he's getting stuck in the ground a bunch. Yeah? What an idiot. Stupid bird. Oh, he should be dead. Is he not dead? No. Oh. <laughs> I hate it when they do that. They get so close to dead, and then of course he's got to go through this animation of coming out. Oh, right, I'm dead. That's it. right. And then he exploded. Wait, what is death? Yeah, there's all those Who bullet posses. You can get some blue Pikmin. <laughs> yeah. Kill you, Seer, so not in the way. Oh, he just wants to snag. I don't know where those are there. Well, if you look carefully at the terrible graphics, you can see the eyeballs poking out of the flowers. <laughs> <laughs> and this is even HD version. I think that was the only one up here. Yep. Okay. So now everything's safe. Doesn't everything For look now. high definition? <laughs> sure. Now let's get that back. But you need the blues on that one. You might go through some water. No, he, gets, he needs to get them blues of fucking. Get the petaflower. Get some more of them. Yeah. Might not hurt just to get some more yellows since those were kind of low too. <laughs> it flies so much higher. Oh, yeah. You gonna open that gate back then? I mean, we'll be coming back up here in a minute, anyways. Or could it just have him start on it? Exactly. Take some no, time. Yeah, you know, you're doing some time strats here. I mean, we got plenty of time today. We're not gonna run out. Yeah, it's already half gone. And then cut to the end of the episode where he runs out of time. Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> That's usually what happens when you say things like that. I'm like, oh, I'm flying on time. I'm not gonna run out of time. <laughs> you'll have to come back just for one treasure. <laughs> yep. They kept loading more up onto there, so they kept just sitting there, not moving. <laughs> hey, I want to help! And here on this fine Sunday afternoon, we got a traffic jam at the Onion. <laughs> and all the blue pigments seem to think that they're useful. Air totally. break. Shouldn't that be more than a fucking bottle cap? <laughs> you think? I mean, it's a much more intricate design than a and bottle cap. Uh, it's more value. I mean, I'm sure it could be used for something rather than just a bottle cap that's just metal. That was a little bit overkill there. <laughs> no, you need. Oh a... no, you lost one. You need to show uh, nature's place. <laughs> and de destroy it indiscriminately. Yes. Because you we are man. Purple Pikmin, but your hockitation. They're not man. Hockitation is man. <laughs> They're two inch size men. Yeah. So, okay, I think should be good there. Let's organize our numbers here, then let's go to that cave. A lot of yellows now. Yeah, I don't need that many. Sure you do, what are you talking about? <laughs> Did you see Louie sliding after you had already gone in there? Yeah. That gives us 15 spots to work with. That's actually 16. Six. Oh, right, I guess we, <laughs> we lost a white Pikmin, that's right. Yeah, that's why you my did. numbers are off. You're mathematical. Yeah, save room to replace that one white Pikmin that you killed. Exactly. There we go. All's right in the world. Did you just notice that you had one odd number of Pikmin, so you're like, I'm gonna kill one so that I have an even number. <laughs> yes. Exactly. Yeah, this is probably good. You quick, break down the bone wall. You know you got it. Bone wall? Or whatever that kind of wall was. Well, I mean, Gabe does bring up a good point. We don't know exactly what those walls are made of. Well, the bone wall sounds like a porn video or something. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the bone wall. Prepare to get boned. <laughs> <laughs> it's the boning. Is that for people that are into the pegging fetish? Uh, the what? <laughs> you heard me. Are you gonna have to explain to Gabe what pegging is, Derek? Well, I mean, we just explained how Pikmin were made. We don't need to overload him. 
Well, you know. <laughs> Intriguing. It's My a... acoustic sensors are picking up a high-pitched wail. This is some sweet shredding from a guitar. Their ears are bleeding. <laughs> it seems to emanate an area near this gigantic stump. I wonder if it's behind that weird wall. The bone wall. <laughs> This large root must penetrate deep beneath the planet's oh, surface. You bet it penetrates deep. <laughs> Everything penetrates deep in the bone wall. Now, guys. They're like, but more. But mom! They want to bone wall. Reproduce. Reproduce. Oh, I still have one somewhere. Uh. <laughs> Is he stuck? <laughs> Is that one there? Snag root hole. Maybe. Oh yeah, he's in the water. <laughs> Is he blue? Yes. Yeah. The only reason why it's still alive. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess if he wasn't a blue, he wouldn't be alive at that point. Because he would have been in that water for a while. I'm surprised he go. was still following you that far away and didn't yeah. just get lost. Unless maybe I left him there earlier. That'd be my only other no, guess. I don't think so. Well, yeah, I, I don't know. Pikmin are weird sometimes. Yeah. It's amazing that they've survived this long before Omar came exactly. to this planet. I don't know how even a few of them survived. They are the weakest link. They should all... Yeah, <laughs> goodbye. And welcome to the Snaggrit Hole. It Imagine... was guarded by a Snaggrit. Oh. Does this oh, mean yeah. we get to fight a Hydra Snaggrit? Oh, God. <laughs> I only... Both I wish and don't wish that would happen. Well, it's like the same way that I want the Flood to return to Halo. I want them to return to Halo, but also it would be better for everybody if they didn't. Yeah. <laughs> He's sleeping with his eyes open. He's ready for you. He's coming. Jeez, he's faster than I remember. <laughs> he works out. Well, he's got them long legs. He does a lot of cardio in the morning. Come on, buddy. I just want you to... Yeah, go to sleep like that with your back exposed. He's like, well, there was something down here. I better turn my back to it and go back to sleep. That'd be a good way to solve all my problems. Not exactly how I wanted that to go. You're breaking its butt! <laughs> but, you know, it worked out. There's a marble in its butt. Man, it must have been constipated for weeks. Yeah. That's why it couldn't sleep very well. It was Apparently. in a white sleep because it couldn't sleep because there's a marble jammed up its ass that's about as big as it is. If I eat more Pikmin, I'll be able to push the marble out. <laughs> <laughs> Quick, get the small bugs too. Nah, no need. What, what Juice them for a souffle. Do you think that uh, the white Pikmin could be used as some sort of like stimulant to get you to have to go to the bathroom more? <laughs> I think it'd be a stimulant to kill you. Well, yeah, I mean, you don't want to take too many of them, otherwise you'll die, but... Maybe the yellow Pikmin will kind of get you going, you know? Get things moving down Restart there. Restart your heart. <laughs> I mean, how often are in this playthrough are we going to talk about, like, what Pikmin tastes like, or... Well, the funny thing is, when I was on our YouTube channel earlier, I saw that we were, there was a title of a Pikmin 1 Let's Play that was talking about what Pikmin tastes like. So it's often a common theme in Pikmin Let's Plays. <laughs> yeah. Was it the one we did, you mean, or...? Well, I mean, it, it would have had to have been, weren't we the only ones that did Pikmin? No one gave was ever in on a Pikmin 1. I oh, no, he wasn't. Yeah, I don't think I was either. Man, that feather looks so fluffy. That's so fuzzy, it wants to die! Wouldn't that be great if there was a Pikmin with a leaf that big? <laughs> Did he get a Mega Mushroom? <laughs> yes. Oh god, could you imagine of a Pikmin course. with a Mega Mushroom? <laughs> How big it would be. It just goes up to an Emperor Bulbax and punches it in 10. the face. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Leviathan Feather. It's like a... It's like kaiju battles, yeah, it's like a giant Pikmin battling just bold orbs. <laughs> you, don't, you don't have enough badges to train that Pikmin. And then there's like a uh, Emperor okay, yeah, we're orb. Good. Are you gonna bring that one back there? I mean, uh, we don't have to worry about that. It'll join us automatically when we go into the hole. <laughs> what, if, what if he didn't want to? What if he slept? What fell asleep <laughs> after he got that feather bag. He's like, man, that was heavy. <laughs> 
This is a dramatically different landscape. <laughs> yeah, this is why. <laughs> How exactly games are does dirty. that work? And this is under a tree. Yeah. This wide open oh, totally. area that looks like a grassy field is underneath a tree. Yeah. That makes perfect sense. I see no flaws in this logic. Go, Grubs, go! Eh, boulders. Nah, uh, yeah. I'm just waiting for those <laughs> to happen at some point. We've seen the bombs already. It will happen when you least expect it. Yeah. Fine, you can take that back. It tried to kill him, so he's like, well, you know what? I'm gonna take you and turn you in for cash. Money! It's probably worth, like, half a penny. Uh, they're so cruel, having, you know, yeah, this path here. two of them. Well, yes, two of them and this narrow pathway <laughs> to move Pikmin across. Yeah. In Pikmin 2, where they don't really follow you that well. Yeah. That's fun. So. Good luck hmm. with that. Throw Olimar off to the side. Oh, does he? They go? barely dispersed at all. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> they really separated pretty well there. They're like, okay, guys, <laughs> take a break. Okay, there we go. This is what I want. Kind of. Well, <laughs> the whites kind of got mingled in there, too. I don't know if you got any of those. All but one. Uh, I think we need to use our sprays if we want to get through this without any major casualties. Kill them all! Oh, look, an eyeball. Yeah. He's just like, hey, come a little closer. I dare you. Wait, plants don't say anything. Yeah, I'll use this. I think it'll wake up the other one. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and there goes one Pikmin. And here comes his buddy over to get some Pikmin. Nom, nom, nom. Mmm, he got like three of them. <laughs> but what <Dad>? was that? <laughs> he didn't even need to do that. Wouldn't this be the helpful part if you could have two people there? In oh, Shearwig's over there. Yeah, that would be nice. But remember, it took them 20 years to have campaign multiplayer in Pikmin. <laughs> Despite the fact that they have two uh, captains in this game. Yeah. And they still can manage it. Not even for the HD re-release. Nope. It's an impossibility. Oh, no, there you go. Well, at least... It's not the kind you used, but it's... <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's still useful. Oh, I should have multiplied that. Oh, well. Oh. I'm trying to glitch the game out again. Dare Watch it just instantly crash on you. You better watch out. We use can't handle things very well. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine it trying to run Skyrim. Oh, God. <laughs> Skyrim wasn't on the Wii U, was it? No, it wasn't. It was wasn't until, until the Switch. yeah. It wasn't until the Switch. It that wouldn't it got surprise released. me if they made a Wii U version of it. Sushi. Mmm. -mm. Nothing like some sushi buried underneath a tree for God only knows how many years. Dungeon sushi, my favorite. <laughs> oh yeah. It's even better than a whole rotisserie chicken found at a dumpster. And that's a giant ass strawberry. Oh my God, that thing is huge. I wouldn't be surprised if that thing had legs and started trying to kill it. <laughs> yeah, that's actually a monster. It's a straw borb. Just... I don't have fun getting all those assholes across the bridge. Without them all dying? Uh, <laughs> you just gonna throw them? Yeah. You're really shaking that thing. Don't shake the sushi. It It'll just falls up. apart into multiple pieces. <laughs> It'll just wake up and go after stuff again. It's not a, a bull bear. Could be. It should be, because that would be great. Yes. There yes, needs a bull bear right now. One thing I kind of want to know with this bucket is it's kind of weird in that uh, if you get closer, you can kind of hear uh, little uh, baby chickens in it. <laughs> what? I don't Why know. Why are there baby chickens in there? I don't know. I don't think we can really here just because we have the volume low, but uh, for those listening at home, they might e hear it. Well, why was that one having such a hard time carrying that sheer wig? Uh, uh, guys? There you go. There's only 21 on it. Oh, more sheer. Oh, no, that's a sheer grub. 
Oh. Yeah, the inferior land variety. Died with a Pikmin in his mouth. That's the way he wanted to go. <laughs> Eating. <laughs> Death with a full belly. Or I guess he didn't even have a full belly. He just knew the taste of a Pikmin as he was dying. We didn't even give him the honor of a last meal. <laughs> Meals? Why would, would you want it to have a meal? You should have gave him a white Pikmin. That would have been a great meal. If they fall in the water, I'm gonna... <laughs> You're not gonna do anything. That would be great. Yeah, you're gonna watch as your Pikmin struggle to make it over. Probably, honestly. <laughs> I mean, if that was realistic physics, those Pikmin probably would have fell off into the water. <laughs> and the strawberry would have crushed some of them. Taste sensation. Do you think that sushi's moving around so much because it's like full of maggots because it's been down here so long? Oh, definitely. <laughs> yeah. That's not even rice. That's just all the maggots. Why do you think it's only worth 40 pokos? <laughs> no one wants that thing. It's a hazard. Do you imagine transporting raw fish through space? <laughs> yeah. What it looks like when it finally arrives. <laughs> 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 like, I swear, Mr. President, this was good when we were on the planet. <laughs> the smell alone has killed three of our other employees. <laughs> you open up the treasure hatch and it just smells like garbage in there. Okay, now that's nothing. The suspense is killing me. It's got a butt. <laughs> a weird lopsided butt. Combustion berry. And that is an expensive strawberry, goddamn. How much was it worth? 190. That's like almost twice as much as a bottle cap. Yeah. I like how our frame references the bottle cap. <laughs> yeah, I suppose we'll just go on. Well, it seems like half the shit's just priced at 100 anyways. It's like when you get tired of pricing things at a garage sale. Oh, just put a fucking dollar on it. Yeah. Fuck it. 